What's good, Homo Squad? It's your boy, Homo Ziggy. We back here with another reaction. And look, sorry, y'all, if y'all see me wiping my eyes and such. Look, by the time of this recording, it's like 12 7. 12 7. See? 12 37 p.m. August 12th. I literally just woke up like 20 minutes ago. But it's like this, y'all. I fall. Sometimes whenever no, when it comes to me most of the times, especially if I don't have I'm not going nowhere, nine times out of ten I'll be waking up like in the afternoon afternoon. So that's why most of the times you will see reactions that I do from like last night be uploaded the day uploaded the next day at like ten AM and so so that's why. But regardless of that, we here with Fable with his Buddha Buddha song, anything inspired by record of Ragnarok. So it's basically like this. The backstory to this song is because Fable noticed that on his chan on his main channel, which is this one, in his words, right, saying that something is going that his channel isn't in isn't like improving as much and such. So he wants to go heavy on it. So. But hey, I don't blame him. If he wants because if he wants to make sure his main channel is making more, is going bigger and bigger and bigger than like his second channel, hey, I can't fit, hate on him for that. So we better check this out. Hopefully this wakes me up. Make sure, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on all my socials up there. And without further ado, let's get in the video. Original link to this song will be down in the description. And make sure y'all go tell Fable I watch it. Hello. First of all, this is a different. Hold up, I want to make sure. Let me hopefully this don't like go crazy and such. But hold up, this is a different like upbeat and such. Cause he did said he wanted to take his time on this, and trust me, the way how it sounds so far, within these first twenty, these first like thirty seconds of it, I'm pretty sure we about to get something. Pretty exciting, so if I don't save us, then who the fuck will enlighten in the mind? But I always shoot to kill. Hate me, hate me. I like that little bit. The battle lies within. Had this question in your day. Oh, I like that little stare, that little effect right there. That anything, anything. Like it's bouncing off one ear into the other. I like that. Hold up, run that back. Then we bounce back and such. Mm. Like the bounce back on that. What's that melody? And there's that mixture of how he does the rock and then the rapping. But what's that little flow right there? That dun dun. 
ain't that from what that ain't that little melody right there from one of his songs on his second channel what was it y'all can remind me in the comments because i i remember reacting to a song from like his second channel his video games like channel i remember it was a song that had that type of same melody that dun, 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 dun. or am i trip or am i tripping out i'm pretty sure there was a song like that that had that same method i can't remember it's stardust stardust please bring back the thrill i can see your heart i can see you lost the will play me play me i, can yeah, I gotta remember let me remember Bro, it's basically like this. One thing with Fable, right? That in the realm of how Nerdcore was, right? In like this little bubble, how it was starting, right? Before it became this big thing now. Not to say it wasn't big before, but with the way how it was at the start. Like normally most rappers wasn't like, in a way, not saying cursing or so. I'm not saying not to curse or anything, but what I'm saying, like, there wasn't like being much more of saying screw what just because i'm a nerdcore artist i can't curse nah f that it's my song if i want to curse i'm a curse and the, to be honest that's how fable has always been in such not to say the other nerdcore artists don't ever curse in such in their songs sometimes they do sometimes they don't but with fable if he's gonna express himself in such Especially if it's in one of his way, if it's basically in his songs, he gonna express it no matter if there's curse words or anything. So that's and I don't and the thing is, but my parents or just my family in general, we were talking about this like on the side with unlike a personal thing as such when it comes to music and it has curse words in it. All I'm saying to me, I've always said that. If you're expressing yourself in such more in your music, sometimes you need to add in a little F word here or S the F word, which is F U C K one, then shit, then all that and such to really emphasize how you feel about something or someone or whatever and such. So maybe they maybe they maybe they say they you don't have to do that, but I'm just saying for me. And if y'all agree with me, let me know. I like that little bounce back, man. Always gonna like when I run, when the artist does that, where it gives that, cause like how you wearing headphones and such, you always like when it has that bounce and such. That bounce there, bounce there, bounce there, bounce there. Like, bro, it just really emphasizes of how our song is. Here we go. Dream state. basically like this i know i'm still in a way a little bit sleepy and such but it's always like a fable song fable songs are always going to be the songs that really wake your way just 
want to say like it's a big hand and just slap you awake. And it's like this, knowing how, and I haven't seen the show yet, right? I promise y'all, I'm going to watch every anime, every show, whether it's on a Netflix, Crunchyroll, one way or another, right? For all the songs that has been like, popular, for all like the anime inspired songs that has been coming out and such, from like Record of Ragnarok, should I still, I don't know if I want to still watch it, maybe I will want to watch the Spider-Man Across the Spider-Verse one. I'm gonna make sure I want to catch up on them because and I hear that there's season two that's coming up for this one so who knows maybe I'll probably watch it tonight I don't know but just to sure when it comes to the certain animes that the nerdcore artists are putting out I'm pretty I'm making sure I'm on that bit like that Just love that bounce back with the word. Of course, Boom Drums produced this. Of course, Bloom Gum produced this. Why wouldn't I notice that? Freaking blooms gums with that, because the way how it sound, of course it had to be like a blooms gum production. But hey, man. Hopefully y'all enjoyed this reaction, man, because I know I did. It really wake my ass up and such. Because like I said, I still feel a little bit sleepy, but after this, it really, well, in a way, it really woke me up more. But either way, y'all let me know what y'all thought about this down in the comments below, and if you made it this far. Comment down below anything. Comment down below anything that that makes me know you made it this far and you're a real Humble Squad member. And also, if you want to become a member on my channel, click that join button down and so where the subscribe button is. And for just $9.99 a month, you're a real Humble Squad member. If you want to do it, cool. That will, I will really appreciate it. If you don't, hey, at least you're still subscribed to the channel. But y'all let me know what y'all thought about this down in the comments below. Make sure to go check out my other reactions right here. Follow me on all my socials up there. And stay positive and keep the vibes up. Here you go.